Monkey 1000 and today we are in Jacksonville at a state park and we are over by the ocean at the moment. I haven't showed anything because we've been busy trying to put the tents up and all that and I really couldn't show you much because I had to drive. So Shea Bear's got some footage I'll probably steal from him later on. And uh, so we're at the beach right now. So dogs are allowed at the beach here and we are not far. We're in between the beach and the lake. So we want to do some fishing and we got walking we can do and all kinds of stuff. So stay tuned. Okay guys, so right now we are at the beach. Dogs are allowed as long as they have a leash on, which most beaches, um, you know, you're not allowed to have them on the beach and all that. So here we are. It's getting windy, so sorry about the noise. You'll have to lower your volume. This is your beach warning flag. We are in the yellow, so it's a medium hazard, and it could be because we have a storm that's supposed to be brewing this way. Bruno. And uh, so we're going to go on the beach, and I'm going to show you. I used to live in Jacksonville many moons ago. We didn't really come to this beach much because we were always in Daytona seeing my parents, so we went to that beach. So I've never been here, but I'm on the beach one time, that's it. So here they got some new natives here, and it's all the different flowers and, and stuff, you your turtles. We have our turtles here, that's pretty cool. Huh. That's really neat, look. And you have your shells. This is called Hannah Park. If I haven't mentioned that yet. I'll show you our spot and everything. Um, when we get back, we just decided to go to the store. They do have a store in this park. It's a nice park, um, but I'm disappointed in our area where we are. We are in the RV part where we, we're allowed to tent there, but we have to pay extra. And um, it's not private, so we were kind of disappointed there, and I thought it was gonna be private, and it wasn't. So there are spots there that are private. They have bushes in between and stuff like that, so. off. Well, you don't eat it. I think he's trying to trying to eat the sand. Come on. Come on. Go down here a little bit. And there's that big ship over there. Wow, isn't that cool? He's looking for treasures. Oh. Yeah, we can bring the poles down here. sand and bring our chairs and sit out here. That goes for miles. Pretty cool. Yeah. We're just checking it out right now. So. Let's see what we can do here. Okay. So stay tuned. There'll be more. Okay guys, we're back at the park and here's the card. There's Shea Bear over there. He just strung my rod again. Put some new stuff on there. There's our tent. And this is what I mean is that we have that next door to us. So 
you know, it's not the nicest spot, but it's a spot and we'll make it work. Now over here, if we had that one, you have all the trees, you see, and it would have been a lot better, more private. So, so I was kind of disappointed, but that's okay. So we're going to try to do some fishing. And let's see, we got a tripod ready for food. And we got our picnic table. There's Bruno. He's a happy boy. So we're going to go and do some fishing right now. And uh, I'll turn you on if we catch something. So stay tuned. Okay, guys, we're down by the lake, which is not far from our campsite at all. We can walk here. And this is what it looks like. We are fishing. We have shrimp on. Tomorrow I think we're going to go to the bait shop. The, they're, they All they have was shrimp here. and uh, So we'll drive into town a little bit. It's not that far so we can have uh, some bait for tomorrow. This is a park over there. It's a water park for the kids. They got a little parking area over there. We could probably go over there and try fish if we want. Yeah. There's people down there. They're fishing off the bank there. And it's, it's pretty through here. I don't know how big this is, but um, I don't think it's that big. You know, so. Anyways, we're going to try. Yeah, you can't swim in here because there are gators in here. So, I don't know what that box is there for. I have no idea. Uh-uh. So box for something. I don't know, maybe emergency. There are a lot of turtles in here. We were, I was over there with Shea Berry at the picnic table there and there was a lot of turtles over that way. A guy did get a fish. He got a big fish. So, we'll see. And we'll get some more bait tomorrow so we can fish some more and try that. So anyways, if I get anything, I'll, I'll turn you back on. So Shea Bear caught a turtle, another one, but this is a soft shell turtle. Yeah. Ah, yeah, you caught him, didn't he? Oh, look how soft he is. He was little. Yeah. Yep. Cool. Yeah. Oh, neat. Well, you caught something. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Now we just need a real fish. Yeah. <laughs> There's Bruno over there. He's at the picnic table. I tried over here. And there's a boat down here. Looks nasty. Looks like it's been here for a while. Yeah. So. Oh well. <laughs> there is a lot of turtle in here. So. Especially over there. That's why I came over here so I didn't catch one. I don't really want a turtle. <laughs> so. Anyways. Stay tuned for more. Hey everyone, this is Monkey 1000 and today it rained most of the day so we slept and hung out in the tent and then we got hungry so it took us a while to find a restaurant that would take Bruno. So um, we did. We found it by the marina. There's a restaurant over there. And we are right by the marina here. So it was seafood. Um, but we had, I had chicken nuggets and Shaber had a hamburger. So I had shrimp the other night, so I didn't feel like seafood. But yeah, it's nice in there. And um, yeah, so, and they take service to animals. So we took Bruno in there. We had no trouble. Anyways, this is the big, big bridge here. And we saw this little park, so we thought we would stop and fish for a little bit here since we couldn't really fish out where we were. We didn't get anything, so there's those big huge birds. See that? So it's been raining on and off, and that's okay. And we'll see what we catch. Hopefully, we catch something because it's been a bummer day. You know, but a relaxing one. Yeah, it did, but our tent did well, didn't it? Yeah, not one 
not one leak in that tent and we were in it until what two o'clock and then we came out about one one yeah so we came out and about to find food it took us a while to find food and parking it was horrible so Shaber found this online and we came here got these big boats here this one right here's got hashtag Brittany so it says uh, free Brittany hashtag free Brittany that's what it says on that yacht huh Your camera. yeah there you go. so anyways I, I looked it up and it's to free Brittany Spears from her father to uh, taking control of it, uh, her money so that's what that's about but that boat over there is got the bilge pump going and it is just coming out. It's still coming out, so Shea Bear figures they got some kind of leak going on in that boat. So there are people on it. Um, they were up there. Girls were up there hanging out. You could tell they were... Huh? Party girls. Yeah, they were party girls. Yeah. Could be Brittany. You never know. A lot of famous people come to Florida in their yachts. So you never know. Yeah. Oh, we have a lot of famous people here. I had a lot of people around me in Daytona that um, were famous. So, and of course, John DeVolta didn't live that far from me in Oklahoma when I lived there. So, yeah, and he still lives there. So it's pretty out here. I'm just kind of showing you a little bit. And I'm going to turn it off and fish. And if I catch something, I will come back. Look how pretty it is over there. Really, really nice. <coughs> the big sailboat over there. Just sitting there. We want to bring our boat here. Nice place to bring a boat. Yeah, yeah. 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 But we'd have to spend the night somewhere. Spend the night on the boat, huh? Yeah. Because, um, yeah, well, it's about a three and a half hour drive. And if you're boating all day in the heat and the sun, and, you know. You don't want to go home. <laughs> we could boat on until dark if we want to, if we have a place to stay. Look at those birds. They like that rain. They're trying to dry up. So did he eat? Eat your fish? Okay. So I'm going to get off of here because my pole is down here. And if he takes my pole, because I want to catch a good fish. And of course, we left the fishing net at the campground. So... <laughs> Uh, uh. Well, we didn't know we were going to fish, but we just happened to have the poles and the bait in the car, so it was like, yeah, we could do this. So, anyways, if I catch anything, well, I'll be back. Oh, oh. I think I got him, though. Did you? No, I don't think it was recording. Now you have to pay it both buttons. I did. Oh, well. Oh, there, guys. Shaver got a crab. Oh. oh. It's like he sees a freaking net. Let's go. Yep. They know. They know. They're amazing. I think that's what a lot of them are is crab. Yeah. Anyways. Sorry. caught a catfish. Oh, he's a feisty one. There he is. Bruno's cat looking at it. <laughs> this must be uh, a teenage uh, hangout with the boats. Because they look awful dang young to be driving those, but I guess they got to be 18, right? No? 16? Oh, yeah, these are teeny boppers over here on a boat. Mm. I would say so. Mm. I bet you it is. As long as they're good, that's all that matters, you know. Oh, I might have something. I got to go. Sky. 
after all that rain we had today. At least it's nice now. Gorgeous out. Absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. They're still fishing over there. I think I'd like to try that tomorrow. We might come over here tomorrow and go fishing. Let's see. The bird is trying to get our food. We decided to use some meat because we ran out of bait and it'll go bad and we didn't eat it. So we're gonna use it for bait. Shea Bear is going to put the drone there. Get some footage from the drone. So stay tuned for that. He's watching. He thinks if I don't watch him, he'll go get that meat. <laughs> There's something. I was going to try to show you a place, but I'm running out of cards, so I might not be able to film no more. I didn't bring the other one and I meant to. I forgot. So, anyways, this is what happened. This is not my car. This is belongs to that guy right there. They're packing up and leaving. So they parked their car in front of my car so I can't get out. Nice people. Anyways, I want to show you this walkway and hopefully I'll have enough. Stay tuned. Okay, guys. So, I think it looped my, uh, no, it didn't. It's saying zero six minutes. So I'm going to do this and I'll end it. And if I get anything, I'll get Shea Bear to take pictures and stuff and use his video. And then I'll I'll get use his because he's got more room than I do. Anyways, I wanted to show you this. I was going to show you yesterday and it started raining. And then we started doing stuff. We went fishing, as you see. We had a great time. We, we stayed up real late. We found a fishing spot, not in here. And um, we were going out for dinner. That's what we were doing. And we, uh, there's bike trails all in here. And if you bring a bike, you'll have a blast here with the bikes. But Shaver can't ride a bike, so that's no fun. And uh, there's all kinds of trails. It goes all through the whole park and stuff. So, um, yeah. So, anyways. We, we had fun fishing last night. I would have stayed out longer, but we were going to get up this morning and watch the sun come up at the ocean, but it was pouring rain, so we couldn't do that. So it just stopped. It's still drizzling a little bit from the trees, but it's it's not been too bad. I mean, last night was just a gorgeous night. Keep going, Bruno. And uh, it was just a really gorgeous night last night. So... Anyways, I'm going to end this video um, because of my card. Sorry, I need to get a bigger card or some, something so we can take it with us. Ugh, this is muddy a little bit, but that's all right. Anyways, so I'm going to get Shea Bear up and I guess we'll go and try to get some breakfast because we can't, we haven't been able to cook outside. That's why we went out to eat last night. It's just everything's so wet, you know, so that's the bad part of being tender, but, you know, it's, it's fun too. I mean, the rain came down, the camp tent is really great. It works really good. So, you know, we've, we've done fine. Yeah, no leaks in the tent and that tent is old. It's our fourth time having it out though, but still. That's pretty good for 60 bucks at Walmart. So, yeah. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed my videos. And, um, you know, I hopefully we'll get out a little bit more and be able to do some more of this. Um, you know, camping stuff. And uh, now that I got a new car. That was the main thing. I had to have a new car for us to travel. So, now I got it. And now we can go traveling. So, anyways, mosquitoes are bad. I'm going to go back to the site and get Shea Bear up. All right? So, Monkey says she's out for now. Bye, y'all. You have a great day and rest of the weekend. Take care.